Facts that will save your life, part 6. If there's nuclear fallout in your area, take a shower and thoroughly wash your hair, but don't use conditioner. It can bond the radiation to your hair. EpiPens have a second dose. After the first use, cut it open. You will find the syringe with a second dose in it. Poplar trees have a white powdery coating that protects them from UV rays. It can be used as sunscreen if you're ever stranded in the woods. Do not attempt to disassemble a piano. The strings are around so tightly that releasing them can cause them to whip out with deadly force. A falling knife has no handle. Might not save a life, but might save a finger or two. If you are overheating, put a cold bottle of water under your left armpit. If you see someone having a seizure, do not hold their head. Do not try to move them. Do not touch them at all. Move chairs and other furniture out of the way so they don't hurt themselves. If you are allergic to latex, you may also be allergic to some tropical fruit. Some of those trees produce the protein and similar proteins as an antifungal. If on a hike and a bear approaches you and you are certain it will attack, the best thing you can do is lay down and submit by covering the back of your neck. Next, be sure that you spread your legs out. The bear will likely dig into your backpack which will protect your body from being gashed into and protect vital organs. Covering the back of your neck will also protect you from getting scratches there that could be deadly. The reason you want to spread your legs is because if they are together, the bear can easily turn you over, exposing your front side which is the last thing you want. I do not want to ever wish to be in this kind of predicament, but this is the most likely way to escape something like this. If you're lost, doing things in threes is a good way to signal searchers. Chop down three trees and put them in parallel lines, clear three parallel wood lines of brush, make three lines of right stones, blow on a whistle three times. That tends to catch people's attention because patterns like that are unnatural. Don't suck poison out of the snake bite. You absorb it into your bloodstream faster through the membranous tissue in your mouth than you might through the actual bite wound. If you're alone on a subway or bad neighborhood and some guys look like they're about to attack or rob you, act like you're crazy and start talking to yourself or to something that's not there. Like and subscribe so you don't miss my daily videos.